Act 5, Scene 1 of Hamlet opens in a graveyard outside the walls of Elsinore Castle, where two grave diggers are at work preparing a grave. Their conversation reveals that they are digging the grave for Ophelia, who has apparently died by suicide, though the topic is discussed indirectly through their debate on whether her death was intentional. Despite the circumstances of her death, she is to be given a Christian burial, presumably because of her noble status, a point that sparks some commentary on social inequality from the gravediggers. As they work, they banter and exchange darkly humorous riddles, displaying a casual, even irreverent attitude towards death and the dead, which starkly contrasts with the more solemn perspectives of the other characters in the play. Their discussion covers a range of topics, from the justice of Ophelia, receiving a full Christian burial despite her suicide, to philosophical musings on life and death. Hamlet and Horatio arrive at the graveyard, but remain unseen by the gravediggers. Hamlet is struck by the gravedigger's seemingly cheerful demeanor as he sings while working and his casual treatment of the human skulls he unearths, particularly when one of them is thrown out of the grave. Hamlet picks up the skull the gravedigger has tossed aside and learns from the gravedigger that it belonged to Yorick, the king's jester and Hamlet's childhood playmate. Holding the skull, Hamlet reflects on the inevitability of death and the decay that follows, highlighting the theme of mortality that pervades the play. He laments how even the greatest of men, such as Alexander the Great, are reduced to dust after death. The scene shifts dramatically with the arrival of a funeral procession, including King Claudius, Queen Gertrude, Laertes, and other courtiers along with a priest. It becomes clear that the funeral is for Ophelia, Laertes expresses his grief and frustration with the limited funeral rites being afforded to his sister, given the church's views on suicide. Despite the priest's insistence that he has done as much as can be allowed, Laertes wishes for more honors for Ophelia's burial. Upon realizing that the funeral is for Ophelia, Hamlet is overcome with grief and anger. He and Laertes clash emotionally and physically in Ophelia's grave each professing his love and grief for her in a manner that escalates into a physical altercation. This dramatic confrontation highlights the deep turmoil and tragedy experienced by the characters, exacerbated by misunderstandings and the consequences of their actions. The scene concludes with Hamlet and Horatio leaving the graveyard as Claudius consoles Laertes, promising him an opportunity for revenge against Hamlet. This sets the stage for the tragic unfolding of events in the play's final scenes, emphasizing themes of revenge, mourning, and the profound impact of death. Thanks for watching this bookly crash course video. Make sure to check out my channel for the complete chapter-by-chapter -chapter summary playlist.